Hey everybody, Ryan here at eTrailer. Today we're going to be checking out the Brake Buddy Towed Vehicle Battery Charge Kit. So before we kind of dig in too deep about some of the details and how this is going to work and everything else, uh, I figured I'd just kind of address one of the big questions um, that a lot of people are asking. And that is, you know, is this battery charge kit going to work on towed vehicles that, you know, does not have a Brake Buddy braking system installed. So you may have a, another type of braking system installed, for example. And the answer is yes. You know, the, the charge line kit, um, or the battery charger rather, is, is gonna charge a battery regardless on what type of braking system you have. It doesn't care. Um, all that it's doing is, is taking some power from your motor home when you're going down the road transferring that energy to your battery to keep it charged up. So regardless on what system you have, um, you know, you can feel confident that this is gonna get the job done. So a battery charger for a towed vehicle uh, is, a, is a pretty critical component, actually. It's a lot of times overlooked. And I mentioned those braking systems. And the reason really for that battery charger is the fact that uh, every time you apply the brakes, your braking system is gonna use a little bit of your battery power to operate. Well, you know, that can be an issue when you're when you're towing, you know, six, eight, ten hours, multiple day trips, and you know, don't get out and separate your car and drive it around or start it up, um, which is a big hassle. You know, you don't want to get to where you're going, unhook and really look forward to start cruising around, checking things out, uh, making your trips, and you have a dead battery. You know, then you're dealing with jumper cables or a jump box, and it's just it's, it's something you don't want to have to deal with. And so, by using a battery charger, what's going to happen is it's going to essentially maintain or almost trickle charge your vehicle's battery when you're towing it. That way, you know the the power that the braking system uses isn't affecting your battery capacity or your battery life. That way, when you get to where you're going, you're going to have the confidence knowing when you turn the key, your vehicle's going to start and you can go enjoy yourself. Not to mention too, the battery charger is going to help save or extend the life of your towed vehicle's battery. So let's say even if you only make short trips, uh, towing behind your motorhome, a couple hours, whatever the case may be, not enough to actually drain your battery. So you might not think it's a big deal. Well, the problem is if you're running the battery down for a few hours and then it charges and then you run it down and then you charge it and you do that several times, you know, that's going to shorten the life of your vehicle's battery. And so by constantly maintaining it, it's not gonna affect it at all. You know, we all hate replacing batteries when you don't really need to, and, and that would be a perfect situation uh, that you could avoid by just using a charger like this. So you might get a couple more years out of your battery and uh, save you a trip to the store and the headache of getting it replaced. Now, one of the uh, questions that we do get asked is if you're, you know, you're, you're not towing down the road, let's say you're parked overnight or something, and you leave everything hooked up, um, which is something I would probably do, um, so you don't have to disconnect everything. Will you know? Will this still take power from your motorhome's batteries? And it really just kind of depends. If your motorhome's seven-way puts out power out of the seven-way, even with the key off, then yes, power will still be sent here. But you know, as long as your batteries are in good condition your, in your towed vehicle and your motorhome, is it going to affect anything? Probably not. Probably not going to hurt anything. You know, if you have a battery on the way out or something, um, that's where you could maybe run into some issues. Um, so what I would suggest doing, if you if your motorhome had power constantly, you went the key off and you did park it overnight, just pull out the connector at the front. Pull out your six-way. And, and that solves that issue. You're not gonna be stealing power from one vehicle or the other. So just something I wanted to mention and uh, I thought was worth sharing. Now, something you need to think about in order for this kit to work, you are going to need a properly functioning seven way on the back of your motor home. So you're gonna need that 12 volt auxiliary power. That way the energy can get transferred through the wiring up into the battery charger and to the battery. Now, with that said, generally speaking, uh, the majority of, of RVs or motorhomes that we've had in here usually have them, especially the late model ones are almost all equipped with them. It's just something, uh, you know, that I, I wanted to mention that way, you don't know, hook it up, plug in and wonder, hey, why ain't this, why ain't this working right? So just something to think about. Um, but like I said, chances are pretty good. 
you already have it set up on the motorhome side. With that said though, how it's gonna work, so that power is gonna come out of the seven way from your 12 volt auxiliary source, run through your tow bar wiring and to a six way connector, which the battery charger uh, is hooked to. And so that power is gonna get transferred through that wire to the positive side of your battery. And that's how it's gonna charge. And the way it's gonna charge is whenever your motorhome is running, it's generating higher voltage from your alternator. And so it's gonna use some of that to trickle charge a battery. Now it's not gonna take so much power that it's not going to charge your motorhome batteries or anything like that. So nothing to worry about there. Whenever it's running, you're gonna know that the motorhome's operating as it should, charging its batteries, as well as your towed vehicles. So the kit is going to be fused. Um, so it's gonna be protected, you know, if a short or something like that happens um, on your motorhome or, or wherever, you know, you're not gonna have to worry about, you know, smoking all of your electronics and everything else. You'll just pop the fuse. With that said, uh, I, I kind of would have liked to have seen a bladed type fuse holder, not really a huge deal. You know, this one uses the older type bus fuses. You know, people don't really have those laying around anymore. A um, little bit trickier to find. So that would have been cool just to see the, the newer style fuse in there, but not really a huge deal. Fuse is a fuse and it's gonna keep everything protected. So at the end of the day, a component that I definitely recommend. You know, it's, it's something small, but it can save you a big headache. And, and really what it's about too, is just giving you the confidence knowing whenever you're on your trip, that everything's gonna work like it should. You know, you're gonna be able to unhook your towed vehicle, fire it up, and not have to deal with any issues. And that'll finish up our look at of the Brake Buddy Towed Vehicle Battery Charge Kit.